My name is Michael McKillop. Um, I'm a retired Paralympic athlete, but today I'm a golfer that competed uh, at the Irish Disability Open uh, for Cushendall. Growing up, I had a club on my hand from when I was about three years of age. My dad just cut off an old iron and kind of put a grip on it and just gave me the opportunity to use golf as kind of my physiotherapy and it helped with my cerebral palsy. There's so much variety of uh, disabilities in the world in general and uh, visibility is a big massive thing in terms of recognition and, and who you are, what you are. And to see how amazing some of the golfers are. It doesn't matter about the impairment or their disability or anything like that. It was about the ability of being able to get the ball in the hole like everybody else that plays golf. You're really starting to see the world kind of engage with disability sport in general and just disability golf because everyone um, knows that golf is about who can get the ball in the hole. It's not about if you have one arm or, or two legs or whatever. It's about being a, the best golfer out there on the day and, and as we've seen today there were some incredible golfers out there um, with disabilities but they also had the ability to, to get a home one for instance. We had a home one today. Obviously coming from a high performance athletics background um, I've been to major events uh, around the world and I look at the expectation of how events should be run and how they come across to the general public and people turning up and people being engaged and over the last couple of days I've been very very impressed um, especially when it's been the first ever disabled competition and, and the staff being so welcoming and, and open and being knowledgeable about disability and, and um, what disabled people need. It's great to see that Gulf Ireland are actually really invested in, in disability sport. 